Has China finally peaked in its carbon emissions? Or is this just another false dawn? The world's biggest polluter just recorded a drop in emissions. Again. But this time, it might actually matter. China pumps out around 35% of global CO2 emissions, more than any other country. But the first time since 2016, there's a real slowdown. In Q1 of 2025, China's emissions dropped 1.6% year on year, putting them 1% below their most recent peak. So is this the beginning of a genuine shift or just a temporary dip? China's not just talking about going green, they're building green and fast. As of right now, their solar power capacity, over 1,000 gigawatts, half of the entire world's capacity. Wind power, around 600 gigawatts, also nearly half of the world's global capacity. As a result, about 38% of China's electricity comes from clean energy. And it's not just about powering themselves. A study by the IEA in 2023 shows that China produced a whopping 70% of all clean technologies worldwide. That means the solar panels, EVs, and batteries helping other countries hit net zero. Yup, you guessed it. Odds are they came from China. Trade tensions and new renewable pricing policies have also accelerated this shift, even if it wasn't all for climate reasons. China says its emissions will peak by 2030 and hit net zero by 2060. If they actually stick to that, it could lower global warming by 0.2 to 0.3 degrees C. That's huge, but it's a big if, because right now their emissions levels are still sky high and not sustainable. Is China on the path to becoming a clean energy superpower? Or are we just seeing another headline-making blip? If they pull this off, shifting away from coal while helping the rest of the world decarbonize, it could be a game changer for the planet. But the clock is ticking. Are you impressed by China's green revolution? Or are you skeptical? Drop your comments in the section below and like and subscribe for more No Fluff Takes on Sustainability with Jack.